Is America's meat consumption too high? The United States is known for its meat-centric diet, with beef, poultry, pork, and fish forming the foundation of many meals. However, as dietary science advances and health concerns grow, questions arise about the implications of high meat consumption, the optimal dietary intake of animal proteins, and whether plant-based alternatives like legumes are superior. This article delves into these issues, providing insights into how meat fits into the American diet and exploring alternatives. Current Meat Consumption Trends in the U.S. Analysis of Meat, Poultry, and Fish Consumption Patterns Among Americans Assessing if Americans eat too much meat, evaluating health implications of high meat consumption. Optimal daily intake of meat, poultry, and fish guidelines for maintaining health while consuming animal proteins. Comparing legumes with animal proteins, nutritional and health benefits of legumes versus meat, poultry, and fish. Nutritionally complete proteins with legumes, tips for combining legumes with other foods to ensure a complete amino acid profile. Americans consume significant quantities of meat, poultry, and fish. According to the U.S. Department of Agriculture, USDA, the average person in the U.S. consumes over 225 pounds of meat annually, ranking among the highest in the world. Poultry, particularly chicken, accounts for the largest share, followed by beef and pork. Seafood consumption, though comparatively modest, has been on the rise due to perceived health benefits. Excessive meat consumption, especially red and processed meats, has been linked to several health risks, including cardiovascular disease, CVD high saturated fat and cholesterol content in red and processed meats can elevate LDL cholesterol levels, increasing the risk of CVD. Cancer risk, the World Health Organization, WHO, classifies processed meats as carcinogenic, associating them with colorectal cancer. Obesity and diabetes, calorie-dense meat products, combined with sedentary lifestyles, can contribute to obesity and insulin resistance. While lean meats and fish can be part of a healthy diet, the overconsumption of fatty cuts and processed products remains a concern. The USDA's Dietary Guidelines for Americans recommend a balanced approach to protein consumption. For the average adult, the suggested daily protein intake is about 46 grams for women and 56 grams for men. This equates to roughly 5 to 6.5 ounces of cooked lean protein per day from various sources, including meat, poultry, fish, eggs, nuts, seeds, and legumes. Red meat, limit to 3 ounces, cooked, per day or 2 servings per week to reduce saturated fat intake. Poultry, opt for skinless cuts and aim for two to three servings per week. Fish and seafood, include eight to 12 ounces per week, prioritizing fatty fish like salmon, mackerel, and sardines for their omega-3 fatty acids. Legumes, including beans, lentils, peas, and chickpeas, are nutrient-dense and versatile. They are increasingly recognized as a sustainable and healthful alternative to animal proteins. Protein quality, meat, poultry, and fish are complete proteins, providing all nine essential amino acids. In contrast, most legumes lack one or more essential amino acids. Fiber, legumes are rich in dietary fiber, which supports gut health and reduces the risk of chronic diseases, a benefit absent in animal proteins. Fat content, legumes are virtually fat-free, unlike meat, which can be high in saturated fat. Micronutrients, while meat provides heme iron and vitamin B12, legumes are rich in non-heme iron, magnesium, potassium, and folate. Research links regular legume consumption to reduced risks of heart disease, diabetes, and certain cancers. Additionally, legumes promote satiety and weight management due to their high fiber and protein content. While legumes are protein-rich, they are generally low in the essential amino acid methionine. To form a complete protein, it is crucial to pair legumes with complementary protein sources rich in methionine. 
This pairing ensures all nine essential amino acids are available in adequate amounts. Whole grains, examples, rice, quinoa, barley, or whole grain bread. Meal ideas, lentil curry with rice, black bean tacos with corn tortillas. Nuts and seeds, examples, almonds, sunflower seeds, sesame seeds. Meal ideas, chickpea salad with tahini dressing, hummus with whole grain crackers. Dairy products, examples, cheese, yogurt. Meal ideas, black beans with cheese quesadilla, lentil soup with yogurt garnish. Soy products, examples, tofu, tempeh. Meal ideas, stir-fried tofu and edamame with lentils. A sustainable and health-conscious diet involves balancing animal and plant-based proteins. While meat, poultry, and fish provide high-quality protein and essential nutrients, excessive consumption can have adverse health effects. Legumes offer a nutritious, eco-friendly alternative that can diversify the diet, reduce reliance on animal products, and contribute to long-term health. By combining legumes with complementary foods, Americans can meet their protein needs while reducing the environmental impact of meat production. Moderation, variety, and informed choices are key to optimizing both individual health and the planet's well-being.